Hey guys, welcome to my new makeover video. So here we have two different dolls, um, both from the 80s. And now let's start. So the first doll is Riviera Bari, also known as Gold Coast Bark, I think. Um, she is probably from 19, uh, 1989. Um, yeah, so you see, she is in rough shape her hair is very very tangled um yeah it's not in great condition but yeah i will try my best to like give her a good makeover so at first i wash it all and then i'm put on some conditioner and start detangling the doll's hair So, and here we have the second doll. This is Jewel Secrets Barry. Um, she's also from the 80s. Um, I'm not sure from which year exactly, but it might be something about 85, 86, whatsoever. Um, yeah, her hair is also in a rough shape. It's very, very dry and a lot of tangles are in the hair. And yeah, yeah, she has been really gone through a lot, I think. So, yeah, I think she's one of the oldest dolls in my collection, um, but that's the only reason why I'm, is, uh, yeah, I'm not a big, big fan of the 80s dolls and not the 70 dolls. I don't like the 70 dolls. The 60 dolls I also don't like in the 50s. Yeah, this is, <laughs> the only year is 59. And yeah, in this one year, there was, there's this one Barbie doll and I don't want her anyway. So, yeah. That's the reason I'm mostly like collecting um, new Barbies so from like 2020 and so on, or even like the, tra the 2000s and a bit of the 90s. But I must say this doll is very, very beautiful and I will definitely keep her in my collection. So, and now uh, after I rinse out the conditioner, um, Jewel Secrets Barbie is getting a boil wash because she needs that. Um, her hair is so crunchy, and I think um, because of the hot water, the hair is kind of melting and it gets straighter uh, from the conditioner, and that's what I want. Mm. She definitely had a bit of a wave still to her hair, but I think it's just working. I like that. And yeah, um, 
in the end, um, I kind of repart her part line because it was kind of messed up. And yeah, and after that, I kind of scrunched the hair to give her some um, texture. And here we have the Riviera Barbie. Um, she has um, kind of weird hairstyle um, because I think it's supposed to be like a half up, half down situation. Um, but she doesn't even have a path light or anything, so that's the only hashtag I could give her. Um, yeah. Yeah, she's just a, she is just a basic Barbie doll, and yeah, you can't expect too much um, from her. But in the end, her hair tones are great. I like her hairstyle. It's a bit basic, I must say, but yeah, I'm fine with that. So, and here's the dried end result, um, both turned out great, I love that, and yeah, it's time now for cleaning Joel's body with some nail polish remover, because they had some stains on the legs and so on, and yeah, that's the part that's most satisfying for me, because I like that, how the um, dirt spots are kind of removed by the nail polish remover. Um, yeah, I must say the Jeweled Secrets Barbie's legs were a bit sticky, that might do to her age, but I'm not sure if they get like um, even worse in the future, yeah, that has to be expected, but for now I think I'm fine with that. So now let's redress the dolls, um, Riviera Barbie is getting... Um, this Fashion Avenue um, pack outfit whatsoever. Um, I have this outfit many, many, many times in my collection. I think three to four times, I don't know. Um, I love that. And um, Jewel Secrets Barbie's getting an 80s Barbie dress, I think. I think it's 80s, maybe it's even 70s, I don't know. But I think it kind of works for her. Um, I kind of struggled with the um, the uh, top part of her outfit because her arms are kind of stuck in the um, dress. Yeah, but in the end, she turns out great. I love her, so pretty and a great, great quality dress. So now, this is the end result. Here you can see both dolls, they turn out great. I love them so. I hope you liked this video, please leave me a comment or subscribe to my channel and I'll see you in my next video, bye!